Hey you guys, it's me Spongebob number one fan 1003 here and as you can see I'm here with the super duper cute Camp Coral Spongebob's Under Years book and this one is called Sink or Swim and I actually just got this book a couple of days ago and this book was actually just released last month and this is actually a very super cute book and I really really love it. Okay, so as you can see on the front cover, there's adorable little Sandy, Patrick, and Spongebob, and there's some anchovies, and Spongebob and Sandy and the anchovies are actually in the water, but Patrick's like diving into the water, and he looks very scared, <laughs> and this book actually comes with over 30 stickers inside, and that's very super cool. Okay, and here is the spine, and here is the back, it's pretty much exactly the same as the front, but all of this right here okay so let's go ahead and start looking at the pages that are in this book okay oh <laughs> all right so firstly here are some stickers right here and these stickers are actually very super cute I really love the ones with little Spongebob and Patrick I think they are so adorable oh, poor Patrick and Mrs. Puff actually looks very cool too All right, and then there's little SpongeBob and Sandy in the water. They're like freaking out, and you can see sink or swim. And this book was adapted by L. Stevens or Ellie Stevens, based on the episode by Luke Brookshire and illustrated by Dave Ikins. And obviously, this book was made in the year 2022. Okay. So at Camp Coral, all of the campers are going into the water to swim, and everyone loves to do it, but except for Squidward, apparently. <laughs> Alright. And it's pretty obvious that Mrs. Puff, the camp counselor, has lots of rules, like no running or yelling or diving or splashing, no finny dipping, and obviously no sinking. And all of the campers are just playing and hopping around, like they're jumping around, they're splashing each other, they're basically dunking each other into the water as well. And little Spongebob and his two best friends, Sandy and Patrick, want to go in the water too, and they're very excited to swim. And Sandy and Spongebob go into the water and they're having lots of fun playing in the water together. And Patrick's a bit reluctant to get into the water, so he goes, but he, but he goes ahead and jumps in, or dives in. And he does a belly flop and starts sinking. And obviously Sandy and Spongebob start to freak out because that's the most important rule, no sinking. And Mrs. Puff saves Patrick, and he really wants to learn how to swim and he starts to cry and Mrs. Puff said that he'll give him swim swimming lessons and he'll get a swimming badge if he does good. So Mrs. Puff and Patrick get into the water and she gives him a little kickboard but he starts sinking and even in the bird bath Patrick is sinking. Even on the beach he's sinking and he drools a lot. He like drools a lot and he even sinks as well. <laughs> So, um, Mrs. Puff's, Mrs. Puff decides to put Patrick in the kiddie pool, like the baby pool, or pollywog pool, and he's sucking on a pacifier and he looks very, very mad, but Sandy and Spongebob decide that obviously if Patrick can't have fun with them on the surface, then they'll have to go on the bottom of Lake Yucky Muck, so without Mrs. Puff noticing, Sandy, Patrick, and Spongebob sink into the water and they're going to have lots of fun together. So they play underwater volleyball. That looks very fun. Imagine floating playing volleyball. And then they even have an underwater picnic but the food ends up floating up. And then they have an underwater karate meet and then they obviously Sandy plays a fiddle underwater and they have a dance party on the bottom of the lake 
And Larry and Little Bubble Bass actually notice the bubbles and stuff. So they think that they're having a dance party. So they actually, um, like, spread the news to the other campers that SpongeBob is having a dance party at the bottom of the lake. So everyone at Camp Coral comes to the bottom of the lake to join SpongeBob, SpongeBob, Sandy, and Patrick's little dance party, and they're all having a wonderful time. And Mrs. Puff noticed that the other campers are gone, and she thinks that they all sink, and then she dives into the water and realizes that they're not in danger at all. And, well, well, she thinks that they're in danger, but Spongebob reassures her that they're not in danger. And, um, that actually makes Mrs. Puff so mad because they, they broke the rule. <laughs> and, obviously, she says, no sinking! And she puffs up so huge that she basically sucks out all the water and now everyone is literally in the polywog baby toddler pool. And apparently Patrick is missing from the group, and Mrs. Puff didn't just soak up the water, she also soaked up Patrick. And Patrick actually finally got the, got the hang of the swimming thing. <laughs> and Mrs. Puff feels like she's gonna throw up. She's gonna be sick. <laughs> and that's actually pretty much all for this book, and obviously, here are the rest of the stickers. And some of them were exactly the same as the previous ones. But, um, these ones are very, very super cute. So I love how shiny they are. Alright. See? Okay. And then here is an advertisement for some other Camp Coral books. Right here. Alright, so that is actually pretty much all for Sink or Swim. This is actually a very super cute book. Um, my favorite part, um, was probably when they had their little party under the lake. And I thought it was really funny how Patrick was getting the hang of swimming, but he was in Mrs. Puff's belly, and <laughs> Mrs. Puff is not happy, so I thought that was a very super funny ending. Alright, so I hope you guys enjoyed this video. So goodbye everybody, have a great day, and peace out.